Gran Turismo 7. It's a game that everybody's been playing at the moment. Um, and if you haven't already noticed, I've been streaming it on both YouTube and Twitch. Um, go check out Twitch and subscribe here to, to see those videos. Uh, but when I first heard Gran Turismo 7 was coming out, I did wonder whether I should actually buy it. I don't actually have a, a PS5 and I th I looked at the graphics and all that in the trailers and I thought there is no way a PS4 can do that or at least do that well um, or it might cut the frame rate or something. I didn't know um, but PS5s are hard to get at the moment, at least in my country anyway. And uh, when you can get them, they're very expensive. So I just decided to buy the PS4 version. So I've spent quite a few hours on the PS4 version now. And uh, let me give you my take on whether or not I think you should buy the PS4 version uh, because is some people might be waiting out for the PS5 version once they can get their hands on a PS5. Um, but in my opinion, after actually using it on the PS4, I actually don't feel like I'm missing out on too much. Let's uh, let's talk about graphics. Um, in terms of graphics, I think they're actually pretty good on the PS4. Um, it actually surprised me. I, I thought it was going to look a, a bit worse. Um, in fact, if I'm a PC gamer that normally games on the sim, uh, there are some PC games that don't look as good as what this PS4 can do with Gran Turismo 7. Um, I thought they were pretty good. Um, frame rate seems to be okay. Um, Obviously, what you're watching now is a little bit degraded because my recording software will degrade it a bit and uh, YouTube compression will degrade it a bit. But for the most part, like, it's pretty good looking. Um, so I don't feel like I'm missing out on a lot here. Yes, the PS5 version does have ray tracing and all that for replays and that kind of thing. But for the most part, when you're actually driving, the PS5 doesn't have all the, the ray tracing and all that for when you're driving anyway. Um, so, you know, I, I think it's actually all right. Um, I don't mind missing out on some of the ray tracing and all that for the replays. And, uh, yeah, for me, it just seems to look good enough. I can have fun with this. Um, I don't really get a lot of stutters or anything. Sometimes when I first load in, maybe, yes. Um, the PS5 will also help with load times when you're loading into the game. Um, simply because PS4 does take a little bit longer to load and it does have a normal hard drive in a PS4, or at least my PS4. Um, if you have a PS4 and want faster load times, you can always just replace the normal hard drive in a PS4 with an SSD and that'll actually give you the faster load times of a PS5. Um, but for the most part, um, yeah, it's, it's a bit annoying with the load times. But other than that, it's alright. And the good thing about buying the PS4 version as well uh, is if you're like waiting on a PS5 or something to come and so you and you've got a PS4 um, you can actually just buy the PS4 version and then you can upgrade the PS5 version from the PS4 version for a little bit extra so they thought about that uh, which is good they know that PS5s are hard to get at the moment and uh, when you can get them, they're pretty expensive. So uh, it's good that they've bought out the PS4 version for the, the millions of people that are actually still on PS4s right now, like myself, um, that I'd like a PS5, but uh, it's just difficult to get and expensive when you can. There is obviously uh, the haptics and all that. You miss out on the PS5 controllers. Uh, 
but to be honest, like uh, we're, we've been driving Gran Turismo for years without the PS5 controllers, so uh, you know, I, it is what it is. And uh, if you've got a wheel, uh, even better. Um, even though I have a sim rig and everything, and uh, I normally do drive the sim, I've just been playing this game on the couch with a controller. Uh, for me, Gran Turismo 7 is a bit more of a laid-back game where you can have fun, and uh, yeah, that's what I'm doing with it. Yeah, if that sounds interesting to you, uh, come check out one of the streams uh, and join in and uh, talk and chat. It's good to have some people there to talk to while I'm racing. And uh, yeah, uh, thanks for watching the video, everybody. Hit the like button if you liked it. Subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you in the next video. Shh. <laughs>